the Emory and Henry Esports broadcast. We have a bit of an unusual one for you today because uh, Jacob, Scubert Dubert, and myself are not in the uh, studio, but we are joined by star player Dylan Hispanard Forster on commentary. A rare treat. How you doing, Dylan? Doing great, guys. How about you? Doing great, man. <laughs> We're hopping right into this first match. Yeah, we, we, first we, match. Uh, we got the Pyramitha me sword fighter matchup. What, what, what do you think about this, Dylan? Uh, so Pyramithra is probably one of the best characters in the game. Yeah. She's just she's just a fly that buzzes around everyone. So. Uh, yeah, very flexible. It'll be interesting to see how me sword fighter can deal with it. Yeah, it seems like me sword fighter has fewer options compared to Pyramithra. Swordfighter is just a slower character in general, so yeah. that'll be very interesting to see. Right. He's got a pretty commitment well. already, though, like 40-some percent. Uh, it's a good start for him to be uh, maybe unfavorable matchup. So Avery actually uh, is rocking a new lineup for the Mii Swordfighter. Ooh. Oh, yeah? I, so a few, a few weeks ago, I was dogging on him a little bit because he doesn't use the Tornado, which right. is... Probably me Sword Fighter's best move overall. Oof, big hit. It's just, it's just a kill confirm that he didn't. Yeah, have on. right. So now that he has it, it should be a whole lot more smooth sailing. Is that yeah, the Chakram sure. he had to replace, or what is that? What is that? Uh, he had to replace the Light Shuriken. Okay. So, see there, there you go. Nice. Yeah, the the kill confirm with the up air off of the tornado. Very. Well done, very clean. Uh, got the link recovery, and then he's out. Yeah. A, a Back to zero. zero. Yeah. <laughs> Didn't get any damage on that, unfortunately. He's getting yeah. all these grabs. He has gotten like four, four or five grabs already. It feels like. Yeah. No. Yeah. There's Super. another one. Another confirm into the up air. Uh, he really takes advantage of the up air. It seems like a pretty strong option on me, Sword Fighter. I'm not really familiar with That's a me, great Sword Fighter. Move. Yeah. Uh, just watching him play, I know he takes full advantage of it. Um, Oof, that was unfortunate. Just barely missed there. the kill. Yeah. yeah. Just out of range though, on it, I suppose. <clears throat> Avery's going for these weird smash attacks. <laughs> yeah, I, I think he sees the percentage and he he wants to try to like get it that way, little but... little kill hungry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it's hard, kind of hard to uh, you know resist. It the be, yeah, yep, yeah, that's that a nice. Confirm. And, you know the, the the tornado man. You were right. It's it's it's, it's nasty. Yeah, tor tornado's the best move for me, sword fighter. Yeah. Glad that fine that uh Avery was able to wake up finally. <laughs> yeah, I mean, so far he's doing good. I mean, he's one stock down, but he might be able to secure this final one before he gets knocked out, which would be great. Uh, he's definitely in a rough spot though. Over a hundred percent. There's a lot of ways that uh. And he's on the right now. And, and yeah, yeah, too. Pyra of all characters. Yeah. And ooh, that might do it. Yep. Ooh. All right, that's another stock. He, he, caught, he caught the weird DI, so Avery will lose a stock there. Yeah. So, it's it's a little tight. I mean, pretty even matchup so far. I mean, in terms of player skill, it seems. I feel, I feel like the Pyramithra isn't really uh, taking full advantage of what they do best, and that is just kind of space moves properly. Right. Yeah. I guess that's like the big skill uh, ceiling right. is knowing how to space it. That's a big grab. There, there's <laughs> no mashing. Holy moly. <laughs> that was really interesting. I think once Avery realized, he just kept attacking. <laughs> I think there was a pause at the end. Just like, oh, <laughs> there we go. <laughs> okay, that was, let's that's go. That's weird ending, but hey, we'll take it. That's for, that's enough, Avery. So. Avery will be All right, so we got one stock left on Avery going in around two. Uh, yeah. Like... That's probably good enough. I mean, if he is at least slightly better than his opponent, he'll get at least one stock, hopefully. Yeah, I mean, well done by Avery. Uh, I think that uh, that grab kind of threw both of them off a little bit. Like, <laughs> yeah, I think yeah. so. That was bizarre. <laughs> but yeah, going into the next one uh, with the one stock advantage. Uh, and yeah, I mean, in a situation like this, it seems like the play is just to like play for at least, you know, going positive again. Um, we're getting knocked out but hey maybe you know he can make magic happen hopefully and if you're watching the stream right now there, there's the face of his Spaniard and joining me eventually is the great alex swaggers he's trying yeah, to get into the discord right yeah now. that's what he told me is that he's having a <laughs> it's, i'm actually but, joining the call yeah yeah even though he's but yeah, yeah Scoob anyway <laughs> Scoobert and jay are currently at home they're not on campus but 
we are rocking it for you guys. Yeah, uh, we got the rare, uh, soon-to-be four-man uh, commentary. Uh, Did we even explain why we're not streaming Ace, Ace Team and oh, why yeah. we're oh, doing yeah. this? Yeah, allow, me, allow me to explain. <laughs> yeah, please. <laughs> allow me to explain. So, uh, our match, our the stream was originally meant for the A Team, which we are a part of. Uh, unfortunately, they had to forfeit because they did not have enough players. So, yeah, and yes. we didn't know until maybe 10 minutes before the start time. Yep, yep, sure was. <laughs> so, so. so this is as impromptu as impromptu gets here. Oh, and <laughs> we are Alex, joined yep, by that is Alex. Alex Swaggers himself. Welcome. <laughs> What's up, y'all? Hey, there we go. Hey. <laughs> nice. Well, we're glad to have y'all. This is exciting. Yeah, no, a different you, stream man. than usual. <laughs> we, have, we have two expert opinions now. Yeah, that's yeah. true. <laughs> I'm looking at the Discord I mean, icons, and we have like a nice picture of Dylan and then <laughs> Alex. <laughs> Whatever Alex is. <laughs> yeah, it's great to join y'all. It sucks that we get to didn't get to play this week, but uh, I mean, it's nice to take a win. So right, yeah. I was ta talking to Jay, who was asking me um, what the record for the A team was, so that we could talk about it on stream. And so I pull up League Spot. And I'm like, I'm pretty sure they're 2-3, but, you know, I'll check. And then I look, and it says 3-3, and I'm like, we have not played six games. Like, why does it say that? Yeah, unfortunately, I didn't have enough players tonight. <laughs> yeah, uh, uh, on a short, pretty short notice, but hey, uh, you know, we take a win. It happens. That's why we have yeah. a B team. Yeah, exactly. exactly. <laughs> so we're getting two B game. B team games in a row, which is pretty cool. Uh, exactly. Yeah, and we we did one last week, and we popped off hard. Uh, both. Yeah. All, like all three players uh, did it incredible. Eli had nine nine stock to the other team, and then Avery got what? Or was it Jared? One of them got seven stocks on the next round. It was incredible. Yeah, I think that was Avery. There was a legendary Roy play. Uh, I'm, <laughs> God, I'll yeah, never... watch, watch last week's if you haven't yet. <laughs> Yeah, I may have to go back and watch it a little bit. The, the, it was the second round when Roy was in. I Jay and I lost it. You might even be able to hear Aaron laughing in the background. <laughs> but uh, yeah, we're kind of stuck on this uh, stage select. I don't I don't know what's going on, but uh, I'm sure work out some stages. Yeah, we'll probably get there soon. And yeah, like so, I was saying, um, hopefully Avery will be able to uh, carry a few more stocks before getting knocked out. I, best case yeah. scenario, he's able to, you know, go hero mode and uh, just like take another player out. But um, Dylan, what are uh, we sword or me sword fighters' uh, best and worst matchups? You're asking the wrong guy for that. The wrong um, guy. I, well, <laughs> all uh, right then. Alex, I know. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I, I know. I know Beast Sword Fighter is typically seen as one of the worst characters in the game. <laughs> yeah. So I'd Makes say sense. like Pikachu, Shulk, Ready? top All tiers. The top tiers, yeah. Ooh, Byleth. They like their sword characters. Uh, at least they're like kind of weirdo sword characters. At least. Uh, uh, not there the was some practice going on earlier, I know. It's true, we did see that, but that was against the Wii Fit, so hopefully, hopefully he's got some advice though for his teammate here. A few, a few of us have uh, violets, so. Uh, like you guys play them, or play them yeah, as well. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, Alrighty. As well as Donkey Kong. Out. <laughs> Everybody loves the Donkey Kongs. Oh, <laughs> right, yeah, we're getting right into it with the yeah, the play. sort of neutral gameplay. Uh, we're getting the pokes in. Right. Uh, There's only one stock on us. We really want to make sure we play, you know, slow, patient, careful. That's not um, the way <laughs> well, <laughs> hey, that's gonna be exciting in its own way, as we saw with DRX yesterday. <laughs> it's the way uh, Sword Fighter should be played, but it's not the way Avery <laughs> likes to play. I mean, looking pretty good though. Uh, honestly, uh, it's it's a little yeah. close, but if, if he gets a stock here, then like we're still ahead, even if he loses. Yeah. Oh, Violet's is strong. Yeah, I know. That's the thing. Seventy-nine percent is, I'm certain, in kill range for Violet. Yeah, one, <clears throat> one good space back air will kill here. They keep trading blows back and forth, though. No, it, it, both of them are having a hard time, like actually getting in and Finding doing the something. Confirms. Yeah, yeah. Ooh, this might be something. Oh. Oh man, just good lose. DI. And that should... Oh, oh no. Confirm. Yeah, it didn't jump. He got too scared, I think. Avery going for a read instead. 
Oh, All right. Well, oh. I'm going to take it. Hey, let's... let's go. Uh, Pilot. Pilot, you have a great recovery. What's going on? <laughs> I don't really know what to say about that one. You have the best tether in the game. <laughs> well, you know, those tethers can sometimes mess you up, I guess. Like, I, I'm just trying to give credit to uh, the Albany here. <laughs> that... <laughs> We're 75%. Like, are we going to get to see every get a second kill here? 80, 98 percent, like, oh my oh, goodness, wow. oh, let's go. holy crap, we kept talking about, oh, they might go even and he'll get a stock, but now he's got two now. Avery's snowballing. Just, he could find a way to cheese him right here, this would be great. Oh, well, <laughs> we just spoke a moment too soon. <laughs> Hey, that was an incredible performance, though, for what we, you know, what you could expect out of that. Two stocks when you only have one is really impressive. Avery taking over half of the stocks. For right. This. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, yeah, a really strong start from the B team here. Yeah, and that's we a... Got the camera. <laughs> we got the camera back. Hello. Oh, oh sweet. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm expecting we'll see um, uh, Eli out. Yep, and that's it looks like we're swamping over, too. I know last week, uh, I mean, he could carry, if he can carry that momentum from last week's showing on Greninja, then uh, that would be incredible. <laughs> well, Greninja is definitely his best character, but he's also got a Pichu and a Byleth and a few other characters that I'm sure he'd be happy to pull out for no for just for just fun. <laughs> yeah, he when I asked him last week before the stream, he told me he also played Pyramithras on, but I haven't seen yeah. him play that yet. Yeah, me and him played a lot over the summer. He was really looking at Pyramithra. Oh, cool. I uh, I still haven't got to see the Eli uh, Pyro, so... It's, yeah, yeah. Hopefully soon we'll get to see it, but it does look like he locked in the Greninja here. He's been trying to work out a bit of the kinks, uh, but yeah, he's really been putting some work into it. Yeah, That's I think awesome. I saw him practicing a little bit after uh, the B Team won last week, so... Um, I'm, I'm hoping to see, you know, so far it's been uh, players mostly playing their, their mains, not, not a whole lot of pocket picks coming out on either side. Mm -hmm. So, except for um, Little Mac the other week, right? Uh, except for right. the Little Mac, that, that was... Uh... We're not going to talk about the Little Mac. <laughs> yeah, that was an exception, I feel. <laughs> Wi-Fi Zelda with that Wi-Fi? Yeah, I wasn't playing Doc, sorry. <laughs> I, like, I mean, the Little Mac Gambit makes sense, though, without Wi-Fi. I mean, who knows? It does, it does. I mean, that's what... <laughs> that's the matches you always lose to Little Macs online, so... I would have just gone Zelda too. I think. <laughs> So we're still, again, once again, we're stuck on the stage selects. Sometimes, sometimes this takes the longest out of anything. I remember last week, the other team was being as unhelpful as possible. Very coy. <laughs> they just, they, at they one point, just they were just like, like, we don't really care about stages. I was like, that's yeah, sick. Okay, like, you just, just pick what you want. And we were like, oh, I mean, we'll take we'll take advantages as we can get, I guess. Well, the way they were playing, I would hope they didn't care about stages. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> It was a definitely an interesting decision to just literally say, hey, you guys can just pick all the stages. I mean, that, that's essentially what they told us. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Uh, what, what do we got here? Spear pillar? <laughs> not, a, not a legal stage? Uh, yeah, I don't think we're allowed to go to spear. I mean, it'd be fun. You know, turn on hazards, <laughs> yeah, go upside exactly. down. Small Battlefield, all right. Small Battlefield's a favorite for pretty much all the Smashers here. Yeah. <laughs> Our, co our coach really loves that. Oh, okay. it's, a, it's a cult special then. All right. I'll make sure we'll keep that in mind whenever we're on this. We get the stage select then to see if that's what we go for. Well, uh, I didn't... It's also a pretty good stage for Greninja, so I wasn't surprised to see it coming out. Yeah, pretty small blast zones, right? So well, um... yeah. you get all sorts of all sorts of cheese going on. Yeah. Yeah, I'm kind of surprised that it's uh, on the stage select. I, I know that some places don't have small battlefield. Yeah, I know that. Uh, I know that a lot of stages, or a lot of stage lists around the area have a uh, small battlefield. Okay. Uh, no Yoshi story, which is something the ECAC stage. List right. Does. Yeah. yeah. It yeah, was. I was to the Yoshi about how last week uh, was when I realized we even had Yoshi story as an option because everybody yeah. bans it every time. <laughs> Yeah, no one likes Yoshi's except for yeah. except for Alex. Alex is the only guy that likes uh, Yoshi's. Oh it's man, you gotta whip that out at some point, Alex. Yoshi's <laughs> is my favorite stage for Ike. But, uh, oh, okay, cool. I've been playing Game and Watch a lot. It hasn't been the best pick. Uh, right. I do have Ike though. That's one of my favorite stages to go for. Yeah, it makes sense. 
Well, yeah, you can get a uh, lot of kills off the top platform. Right. Well, we're heading right into this match. We've got Eli, like we say, on Greninja. With the pilot just on one stock, thanks to Avery's, uh, with, with, like, getting a free kill out in the last match. Uh, they're going to be even so far, close percentages. Except now they're not, because of course, Lane of Kama right there. Eli finally hitting a dash attack to up smash. He's yeah, been working yeah. on that a lot recently. Well, that's okay, awesome, then. A lot, yeah. <clears throat> a, lot, a lot of top Greninjas happen to do that, so it's really, really cool to see Eli finally get in there. Well, if there's one thing, you know, you can say about Eli, it's that he definitely puts in the work. Uh, he is constantly looking for tournaments to go to. Oh, oh my goodness. Well, that's just like that, huh? So fast round. It was, what, a minute and eight seconds? Let's <laughs> go, Eli. Yeah, well done, Eli. I mean, really awesome. we, we barely had time. I mean, you know, it was kind of over before it started. Uh, <laughs> yeah. But yeah, that's great. And so that means we're going in. Three more stocks to go. Yeah. Uh, we got three. 6-3, so it'll be a lot of work for this next guy. He's got to get yeah, through. Yeah, they're, they're they're on an uphill battle here for sure. Um, He's got to get through a dominant Eli going on right now. So Most players do save that anchor though, so maybe we'll find somebody like Dylan coming out for the last player. Yeah, maybe some like sort of dead ringer situation. Well, if they, if they play Doc, so... If they play Doc, <laughs> they got the practice. So it'll it'll be a fun time. So oh, going back to small battlefield, looking like I know the stream can't see it because it's looking at my. <laughs> right. Oh, face. we got a Sora. <laughs> the That's Sora, the second let's go. one we've seen, I think. Yeah, the so, second one in two weeks. Yeah, I know. All all around, we struggle with him. Yeah, Sora definitely seems like a it sort of plays on his own you sort of game mode. You have to sort of adjust. Uh, Sora's a difficult character to deal with because yeah. they're, they're extremely floaty. Right. They have a lot of combos. And it happens to look like this Sora knows some combos. I saw the instant double jump forward air that they did there. Right there as well. There's a few uh, Sora reps around our area. so. Interesting. Yeah, well, see, these are the reasons it's good to have you on here. You know these. <laughs> character intric intricacies that we don't. <laughs> yeah, Sora's typically looking for a back air or a forward air. And I've talked to Eli a little bit about it, so hopefully he knows how to knows sort of the avoid drill. that. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I mean, and the hard part about that is when you know, like, something, it's so frustrating to be in the heat of the moment and have a hard time applying it. Uh, it's really hard to break your own, you know, muscle memory, so. For sure. Even if he knows it, like as like you say, you've taught him, then it could be hard for him to remember to do it. Yeah, that's he's getting some good whiff punishes in though right now, and yeah, taking advantage of that. Uh, sort of. Oh, Ooh, caught him yeah, on the that two frame. It looks like. At at this move, just straight up hits the ledge. Oh, I see. Yeah, the sword knows <laughs> what he's doing. Going for it every time. He looked like it might be a little predictable, which you know if he like can react to it well then. Yeah. Eli might be BMing a little bit. Ooh, <laughs> oh, oh, counter. Oh, yeah, that was really counter. good. Oh. I remember Jay last week. You said substitutes like your favorite counter too. It's so cool, dude. <laughs> like the Naruto, like pull out the log. It, it's sick. Yes. And so he's at 140. Oh, it seems just about anything. Oh well, there we go. Yeah. I, I wielded yeah, into existence on accident. Yeah. <laughs> 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 commentator's curse is real dude. excited mm -hmm. every time oh, yeah. Eli has to take into account now that up be at a shield that kills relatively early so <laughs> for sure for sure Which, that's kind of yeah. an interesting game plan in general is to try to space shield moves so mm -hmm. So this sword yeah, is going seems... for that like tilt attack, uh, like on, on Eli's recovery every single time. So if Eli can it react is... to it well, hopefully he can try to punish move. him. It's a good move. It's safe. It hits the ledge. Ooh. Ooh, oh man. no! That's yeah, rough recovery. Really frustrating there. too. Luckily, no matter what happens, we still go into the last match with an advantage um, here. So, if he can get another stock, that's wonderful. But even if he doesn't, we're still up a stock on the final round. <clears throat> Sora trying to pressure Eli a little bit off stage. 
Or yeah, I mean, that definitely seems like something Sora can do. That. Yeah, with the floaty sort of huge jumps and the um, lock-on moves, like... Oh, that move hits so far. It's a good way to get back on stage there, the counter. Yeah. Definitely. Oh, near like a self smash gets oh, the jab. Ooh, oh, yeah. well done. Right. That, that was incredible. Really great. Let's see if, see if Eli like, can close it out here. He gets an opening. Yeah, I mean, yeah, Greninja is certainly known for combos. <laughs> yeah, and 91, that's a risky percentage to be at, but I mean, uh, he's demonstrated. Ooh. Yep. Gonna be playing from the ledge four, here. Four air one into uh, up into four. Ooh, spaced it just right to not get hit by Sora there. It looked like into the forward air, which is really like nice. It's opening here. Anybody starting to throw hail marys. Oh, okay, that's gonna yeah. be it. But hey, two stocks uh, is is decent enough. I mean, that's that gives us a three one advantage. Like we can afford a lot more mistakes than they can going into this last one. Yeah. yeah. True. Let's just hope that Brian's back now so he can close it out. Yeah. <laughs> our, our third guy. Yeah, that was great work for Eli taking three stocks, losing three stocks, so he broke even this round. Yep. That's exactly what you want. Yeah, and like Jacob said, I mean, you know, when you're playing with one stock, the nerves are also on, right? Where, you know, one mistake and you're out. Uh, you have a lot more to work with when you have three stocks going in. For sure. Uh, so we'll see if Bryant can take out this last stock here without losing all three because Sora does not sound like a fun character for Eli's pot of characters. Not Eli, Bryant's pot of characters. So, yeah. Cause yeah, I feel like Min Min would be pretty tough against Sora. Um, um, so, from my knowledge, Sora and Min Min is not great. Yeah. Sora just kind of jumps over everything that Min, Min yeah. does. And then Min, Min just gets bullied off stage way too easily. Yeah, like it seems like Min, Min would struggle against a sort of aerial based character who can yeah, take advantage of the slow wind up as well. Like Yeah, so and I know that Bryant has other characters as well. And I know Lucario Sora is one of the matchups of all time. <laughs> <laughs> It's up there. Seems like it shouldn't be too bad. Yeah, I wouldn't imagine it to be too bad. I would just hope that uh, Lucario gets Aura. But we'll see what happens here. Mm -hmm. Probably have some discussion in the other room right now about what's going on. Yeah. Probably yep. talking about stages and such. Choose your fighter. Min -min. Yep, and there's Looks the Looks like we are team. seeing the Min Min. Yeah, there maybe. I mean, it's We're just gonna see the player spot. diff, like matchup. You forget about it. It's all about the so min min about excellency. How you, about how you play the game, not about the matchup. Yeah. Did you see small battlefield for the third time? No, regular battlefield. Regular battlefield. battlefield. So we're gonna get that top platform there. One of min min's worst stages. <laughs> Unironically. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> yeah, but I guess like you know, the top platform would be really tough to contest in general. <laughs> Yeah, and that's great for Sora because Sora can just kind of go anywhere that he wants to. So yeah, it'll be a match for sure. But it's just one stock, uh, and there's a lot of time to build up the percentage and get that you know get some sort of confirm that can uh, wrap up the the first match. I, uh, I have faith. I have faith in Brian. I also have faith because he's a good player. He is, yeah. In general. There we go, my mic is back working again. Welcome back. I was silent for a while, that was why. I just muted. Right, I, was I was talking for a while and nobody was oh. listening to me. So I was like, <laughs> Everybody's just talking over you, that's the worst, dude. Yeah, I like asked a question and then everybody, and then you guys changed the subject. I was like, wow, that was... <laughs> <laughs> uh, but anyways, uh, yeah. You, it, Dylan, you said matchups. It's about the, how you play the game, not the matchup. And I said, yeah, Dylan, I think more than anybody knows that as a Dr. Mario True. player. Sure. <laughs> Doc, Doc's a bottom that 10 carry. <laughs> like, yeah, I, I've seen some people like bottom five, like bottom three, you know. Like, mm -hmm. They're just underrated and, and overrated characters, so. Yeah. Tier, tier lists aren't necessarily things to listen to. Ooh, man, that's unfortunate. Well, that 34% really before our first stock is dead. 
Sora will go off stage and hit that min min. So. Yeah. Yeah, it's it's pretty free. Um, Luckily, we only need this Sora to mess up a couple times for us to get a kill. Seventy eight percent seems like pretty. Uh, pretty a hundred percent seems pretty good rather. Yeah. There's the megawatt coming out. One hit from that will likely end Sora's life. Yeah. Oh, that could have been it, but we didn't. We weren't ready for the punish there. It didn't seem like. Oh, I don't know. Oh, look at those uh, the, the platform combo. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, he know this guy knows him. He's got to be scared about it. Ooh. But I mean, Brian's playing this well. You know, he's getting into situations where he'd want to be on Min Min. I mean, not right now, of course, but uh. Ooh, I think Min Min makes there. Yeah. Ooh, nice. That was a great recovery from Brian. Yeah, that was probably just the edge of the range, uh, it's is based on how it looked. character to recover from, so great job for Bryant. Looks like he needs just about one hit to close it out here. Oh, nice, uh... No! Dodge. <laughs> My heart is racing, this is stressful. Oh, oh no! Man. Just needs to close it out, 126. I mean, even, it, it even won't take air. much. Uh-oh. Oh, no. No. Oh, oh, oh my goodness. What a great recovery again from Bryant, getting the Phantom Footstool. Meanwhile, the Sora is... Oh, it stopped blocking too early there. Sora's snowballing. Oh, oh my goodness. What a, what a... Oh my goodness. I got to not know what happened for a moment there. All right. That was nuts. That was my mad attack. <laughs> yep, yeah, I think attack. things would have gone very differently. Oh my but... goodness. Bryant was... Too close for comfort. <laughs> that really was. That, that was literally a life or death situation. <laughs> yeah. One right. tech and we'd be uh, we, reacting we, we very down, differently. We'd be down zero one right now. But <laughs> Man. Yeah, more, fortunately, the Sora does not know how to hit the shield button, so we, <laughs> we will take set one. Uh, yeah, that, I mean that was a came down to the wire. Uh, yeah. their, their Sora definitely does seem like their dead ringer. Uh, really seem to know how to play the character a lot of uh pretty slick combos knew how to you know play off the uh, ledge really well so um for sure. a good sora is scary like that yeah um, for sure so I'm, I'm interested to see if uh you know assuming it comes down to bryant again if he, uh we have him last if like he'll stick with the min min if there's a sora matchup or if he'll uh try something else because yeah, like bryant, we... bryant would stick with min min here because that's just his comfort character right now Right, yeah. And I haven't seen the Lucario come out in a long time, so... I don't, yeah, uh, we didn't see it last week either, for sure. Uh, he just... Uh, I mean, he only played, like, what, two stocks anyways with Min Min, but still... I know, especially online, too, Min Min is a way better pick than Lucario. I'm kind of in the same boat mm -hmm. where I have both an Ike and a, Min, or a, and a Game & Watch, and so... Having Game & Watch as a really strong Wi-Fi character is really nice sure. just to pull out whenever. True, yeah. And consistency can also be really important for, you know, competitive games. Like, just knowing what your character does in every situation, or at least in as many situations as possible. Is, yeah, if you're not uh, so helpful. confident with the Lucario, even if it's on paper, a better matchup, then, yeah, it's, it makes sense to stick with the Min Min then. Yeah, for sure. So, what, what, what do we got here? So, we've got... Pyramithra, Violet, and Sora to deal with. Uh, if they stick to that order, I probably would see Bryant coming out first. Pyramithra absolutely gets shredded by Min Min. It's not yeah. even close. <laughs> We're so like good. We about to see all the characters from Fighter Pass Two. Is Violet from Two or is it from One? Just one. one. Yes. Uh, Violet was like the end of one. Everybody were pretty salty about that. Nostradamus uh, over here. They don't call him yeah. Doctor Mario for nothing. <laughs> we are getting the Min Min and uh, Game oh, One. It looks like they're starting the Sora. So... Oh, oh we okay. bet. Man, they predict. They out predicted us there. <laughs> this will be a interesting match. Let's hope that Bryant could take more than one stock here. Yeah, I mean, oh, that, sure. that seems to be the, you know, mo most realistic hope. Because um, we saw already that it's a, it's a tough matchup, and uh, this guy knows how to abuse the advantage. So, yeah. Um, oh, wow. We will he see. All right, this Sora is actually better than I thought. <laughs> <laughs> that's not a good that's, thing to say to hear. That's a really technical thing to do, to do that up tilt into forward air and actually work. Yeah, well, I you know you remember earlier Alex uh, said that a lot of times their anchor 
uh, is their best player, so uh, it seems like he was right with that. Something like that's the case here. Yeah, by far I was most impressed with the uh, Sora uh, out of the three we saw. Like, it... oh, for sure. The Sora took what four stock? I believe that's correct. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, five. Nine Ooh, five. Five. Well, no. Yeah, I'll do it. No. <laughs> yeah, nice little fireball to seal the deal there, and make sure that the recovery can't happen, and. Um, I mean, 72%, like you said, it, two stocks would be excellent uh, under the circumstances, and mm -hmm. it's, it's looking very possible. Oh, we could we could hope so. He does it again. Wow. Yeah. I'm in awe right now. Oh, wow, that's, that's just going to do it, yeah. yeah. This has some really good edge guard. Right, yeah, that's unfortunate. The Sora knows he can go off stage. <laughs> yeah, Min Min's recovery is unfortunately very, you know, predictable, and... So Sora is definitely abusing that as much as possible. Yeah, yeah I mean, we might. Way. Yeah, that's just yeah, it. That's gonna be it. Wow. Absolutely dominating performance from the Sora there. I mean, Brian barely had a moment to breathe. Like just constantly off the edge, getting beat up like in midair. Like after losing such a close one in the previous round, like you gotta feel good coming back so strong in the next round. It's yeah, also for sure. The matchup, sadly. Yeah, no, for sure. I mean, like, there's only so much you can do, and like, once you're off the ledge, I feel. Um, Especially and... as one man, because there's not yeah. a lot of because she has the worst tether in the game. Yeah, it, it's it seems pretty bad. So, <laughs> well, she gets a minor jump from her first upbeat when it's used, but after that, you get no height whatsoever. Right. So I'm interested to see who we're going to go with next. Maybe uh, Me Sword. Me Sword. I was quick. Go with. <laughs> yeah, he Avery. Just fast. snap Avery. <laughs> I'm guessing uh, during the match, Colt had already probably made that decision, is my assumption there. <laughs> yeah, you see the story, you go with the sword fighter. Which means we'll probably be, well, we'll, we will be seeing Eli as the anchor here. Yeah. Take him to town, take him to town, take him to town, take him to town. Don't take him to Hollow Bastion, do not. This is always, I'm glad you know how this feels watching you guys scroll through all the stages wondering. <laughs> Kalos. Kalos. Kalos works. Yeah. Kalos is a great stage for me, Sword Fighter. A defensive me, Sword Fighter. Yeah, so or doesn't, about it. doesn't me, Sword Fighter have a, 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 a wall jump as well? No, me, Sword oh, Fighter does not have a wall jump. Oh, okay. I'm glad you knew, because I genuinely had no clue. <laughs> not, neither does Sora, though. So it's a matter of um, whose space is better here. Right. Which, in most cases, uh, Avery is very good at spacing his moves. It's That's what it seemed like of, from the previous matches we saw him in. It's just a matter of, um, will he throw out random F-smashes? <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, the, the smash do that. discipline um, is definitely going to be relevant. Uh, Sora definitely starting the match with, uh, you know, a certain pace uh, that we've come to know from this player. I mean, it, it's, <laughs> it's tough. It's tough, man. Yeah, for sure. Avery's yeah, yeah. got to figure out a way to deal with the floatiness of Sora. You can't really get many combos off of him. Yeah. I mean, one of, one of Dr. Mario's simple bread and butters is just not true because Sora's so floaty. Wow, right. that killed. Dang. Some, that was some... DI. Yeah, yeah, I feel like DI was a factor there. I, I don't think that uh, Avery was expecting it to launch that far. Um, and there's the F smash. Yeah, I think there was another smash attack there, maybe, but it's yeah, <laughs> this Sora man. Wow. Crazy. What a what a combo. No, no bias in the commentator stand here. It's <laughs> night. Oh my goodness! Man. Wow, wow. This is so Sora is with their off-stage work. Great mash for Avery, avoiding as much percent as possible. Yeah, this, this Sora knows their combos. <laughs> they do, and they seem to be, you know, executing them, or at least, you know, rather going for them a lot more than they did in the first one. Oh, for uh, sure. Yeah, it seems like right. there's a lot of confidence in the player right now behind Sora, like just, you know, uh, and we saw that before, but like, I think the Min Min really gassed uh, the player because this is, you know, really tight, just constantly pressuring uh, this uh, Avery here. Ooh. Nice, uh, yeah, nice that's pretty good. smash attack, yeah. Some oh. good, uh, oh, just missed that. Good from Sora, from Fond Master. 
Yeah, on Matt. Oh, oh no. no. Oh, okay. Good DI yeah, this time. We are luckily on Kalos, so. Yeah. Yeah, he blast zones are nuts on this. Ooh, I thought he was going to get a cheeky little kill there with that. Oh. I keep thinking whenever I see that, like, oh, it's time for a punish, and then nah, you can just, like, dash. And you know, Sora just do keeps it. doing stuff. <laughs> yeah. Yep, fighters pass two. These characters are... They, they have no end lag whatsoever. They can yeah. just keep throwing out moves. Oh, uh, going for that hit confirm just a little too there slow. Nice! Forward air, air. Yeah. Or back air, rather. And, oh, yeah. and that'll do it. Yep. Fair one. And... Alright. Well. The right technique there. So Eli has eight stocks to work with. <laughs> Seems like yeah, it's a the pretty team. uphill battle, but last week he did none. Right. So <laughs> can't rule him out. <laughs> Seems like they made a good decision bringing the Sora first instead of having them the anchor this time. So I wonder if we have another round if we're gonna see the Sora come out in the beginning again. For sure. I would if if I were the coach for their team, I'd I'd seriously consider it. It seems like you know. Um, a bit of a wall right now. I mean, we'll see how um, uh, the Greninja goes, but uh, assuming that's what we're going to see played, but... Oh, for sure. I would hope so. Yeah. I would consider Eli to respectfully be throwing if he were to play any other character. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I would say he's definitely the most comfortable with his Greninja right now. Yeah. He's not afraid to bring out other characters, but the Greninja. Yeah, I mean, in this situation, you got to do what you're best at, you know. Like, yeah. Sora's demonstrated that. Yeah, his little his little mech though. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> that the little mech Sora sounds fun. One hour little mech. Well, yeah, yeah. I didn't even think about that. Like, <laughs> little mech off the off the edge yeah. with uh, Sora. Not fun. Here we go with the Greninja. Yeah. And are we staying Kalos? I know Eli favors Kalos. When PS2. PS2. Great stage. Two. Great stage. Great stage. I, lo I love it. I agree. Yeah, I, I know you're fond of PS2 for sure. Oh, it's your go-to. PS2 and FD take me all day. <laughs> Unless you're Joker, then get me away from there. <laughs> and here we go. I mean, all the chips uh, for this uh, round whoa, are whoa. on. Oh yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You got to go down there, buddy. <laughs> Thank goodness. But yeah, forward. All the chips are on this round for uh, round two. Hopefully, uh, Eli can sort of reverse the tide of the Sora. Uh, we can start. We see right now that like you know, pretty solid neutral coming out. Um, neither getting touched by the either really. Yep. It's a matter of how many stocks can Eli stick with after this match. Right. Three is ideal, but one is kind of unrealistic. Yeah, one one against uh, yeah. Six would be like very, very incredible difficult. if it po works. Possible, but very, very difficult. Yeah. And that just sounds like a stressful time that I'm sure Eli does not want to get dealt with. No. It's very interesting to see these two really like jumpy, mo movement heavy characters <laughs> it's, going against each other. It's like, it's like flies trying to fight each other, you know, just dodging out of each other's attacks constantly. A lot um, of spaghetti happening. Yeah. <laughs> They're staying pretty even on damage as well. They've been really close this whole match. Very true. Which for us is much worse than it is for them because yeah. we, these are our last three stocks. Yeah. It's yeah, a much more gonna... precious resource. It's just going to come down to whoever gets a kill confirmed first here, it looks like. Yeah. Unless we see some offstage play. Or the stray hit. Oh, oh no, no! The pineapple! The bottom. Man, oh, that tragic. is really unfortunate. Hey, it knows that turn. Yeah. <laughs> it's the footstool, get out of there. Great from Eli. You sure that was on purpose? Oh yeah, of course. <laughs> Eli's the master of footstool. It's the parry. The parry, oh, yeah. It wasn't able to capitalize on it, unfortunately. Online parries are significantly more impressive. <laughs> to me, at least. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, I, I, I got scared. <laughs> yeah, I got scared by PS2 this time. Yep. And Eli getting lapped in percents now, so Ooh, to yeah, the roll there. not good. And off the stage, uh, yeah, this is definitely looking uh, bleak, oh, and that's no. gonna get the kill. Yep, it's gonna get the kill there. The good news is that we do have, you know, game three. It's a best of three, so we're not out yet. So 
This, we'll take we'll take this as a learning experience. <laughs> we, yeah. But we see what the Sora wants. See what the Sora goes for. Yeah, I mean, it, it, it genuinely is useful in that regard. Um, hopefully, I, I wonder if we're going to start with um, Eli next round, assuming mm -hmm. that, uh, you know, this is the last one. I think it will be, to be honest. Uh, yeah, might as well, you know, since Eli this seems to be the only one that's gotten any sort of stocks off of this story here, that might be a good call. Nice. It's the hard read. That was, that was, that was spicy. All right, Eli. Come on, Eli, you got this. The reverse commentator bias. The reverse sweep. Oh, full commentator bias going in. All right. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> nice. And the sword will be taking all nine stocks. Yeah. yeah just a crazy uh, performance by the sword there. That was that was like insane. Cheesy, um, cheesy character. The cheesy character for sure. Uh, it's just gonna tell. I'm not a huge fan of this character. <laughs> nah. Nah, I don't think many people are. I think yeah. Sora. Pe I don't. I don't even know if Sora mains are a huge fan of Sora. Like, well, Sora mains are about it. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Say Sora's cool. All the other people say, "Yeah, go back to sleep, buddy. Go back to kindergarten." <laughs> yeah. 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 He's a Mickey Mouse character. <laughs> <laughs> literally. I mean, yeah. literally. Yeah. True. <laughs> so I remember when he was released. I was like. I felt like adding Sora without the, uh, like, Goofy and, um, Donald, kind of, like, I don't know. <laughs> I feel like that Who was kind of lame. It gets Scrooge from, uh, DuckTales in. Oh, yeah. <laughs> great we could see some of those characters in, like, a ton or something. That would be really hard. Right? I mean, I guess the mouse was like, nah, nah. Yeah, I mean, it's shocking we even got, like, the little symbol on his, uh, yeah, like the, the Keyblade. Keyblade, yeah, yeah. yeah. Right, right. Probably paid a pretty penny just to have that. Yeah, I'm sure. Yeah. For sure. You know, you Talker know, I had to like bow before, you know, uh, whoever the CEO of Disney is like, please. And I did, it's Walt. Yeah, had Walt the, himself. And then visit Walt Disney's grave. Yeah, the, the frozen <laughs> head, you know, like <laughs> underneath, underneath Disneyland. Like, all right, I, I really need Sora. And like, Walt's like, what's a Sora? <laughs> So what what do we got here? It looks yeah. like still waiting on stages, possibly. Yeah, I wouldn't be too surprised if we're keeping Eli in here for this first round. Yeah, I, I I'd start with Eli for sure. Um, Maybe not. probably don't want to risk the Min Min into Sora again right yeah. off the front. Yeah, I mean it feels like it'll either be uh, Avery or Eli. Okay, Avery then. So we got oh. Avery coming in first here. Yeah. So let's hope that uh, Avery can actually take at least two here. Two is ideal, three is great. Seems kind of like a mind game for Colton to pick which one to put in first, because, you know, the other team might be thinking that we're thinking that they're going to put the story in, you know, so they might yeah. put yeah. else in just to get rid of Eli. So uh, that might have been a good call after all. Yep, and it looks like the sword will be going in first as Fawn Master steps into the ring. Yep. Yeah. All right. I mean, that's the infinite loop of mind games with uh, crew battles. <laughs> like, yeah. Yeah, there, there's there, there's never a correct answer. <laughs> like, yeah, you can probably, if you were, like really studied game theory, you could probably figure out what would happen most of the time. But man, that'd be you have to really yeah. give it some some that's thought. Just, that's just in general of crew battles, though, because a lot of characters just get counterpicked really easily. Right. right. But start starting off, uh, Thundaga will be uh, Sora's main key here. No pun intended with the sword. Avery's <laughs> doing a little bit more spacing this time around, which is good to see. Maybe yeah, holding back and throwing some projectiles, getting some slow damage. Maybe the experience from last time is already like helping with the download here, because um, sure. it, it definitely see, it seems like a much stronger start in general. Avery is also one of those characters that is good at adapting, so. Right. It's probably the right decision to put Avery in first, as he he knows Ooh. how to adapt. Last tip on the freeze there gets the. It'll just be percent. No knockback will be taken. Thank goodness. Yeah. Oh, Let's what take... a parry into the! Oh my Ooh. God! Wow. Yep, yep, yeah. The shield gonna take it there. And that's the curse of Battlefield. <laughs> that. Uh... I, I I gotta tell I'll tell him after the match. Yes, you don't take Sora to battlefield. That's Sora's best stage. 
Besides, probably besides Hollow Bastion. Go on. Oh, and the, the Lord. <laughs> Well, you don't really you don't really see Sora, so and that covers the entire platform. This character is broken. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. I'm just trying to make a hard read. I would Yeah, that, been... that that was ambitious, I think. Uh it would if it worked it would have been sick. Uh Oh, tried to um, hug the ledge he twice. Dies for that. Yeah, gets punished. It just happens uh with Sora in general, so yeah, Avery going down three stocks to one. So let's hope that Avery at least can... one stock here um, would it, be great. Just put two and two together here. It seems like the B team's having some bad luck with Sora recently. Yeah, yeah, man. <laughs> Much like the A team's having some bad luck with Zelda. Zelda, so, yeah. We, we we have our great. So oh, let's go. We take those trades all yeah. day. Yes, yes, yes. Avery will be taking a stock here. Let's make Maybe. it two, I, I, I believe. Uh, <laughs> uh, nice recovery. Uh, got the grab, uh, puts him back off the stage. What a way to hold out for Avery. And Avery mixing up his recoveries. I'm telling you, his adaptations are great. Yeah. Very good to see from Avery. Ooh, it's good air dodge. That, that would have killed. Goes under the Blizz, or whatever it's called, Blizzaga, I think. Something weird like that. All of a uh... Oh, there we go. Just uh, dash in. Regular old dashing gets that. But... All right. Well, so one stock. So we have one stock to work with. And, uh... I mean, I, I really think that if, if we can get through the Sora Menace with like at least a handful of stocks. Yeah, like, like, three, like four, maybe five. So the Sora's definitely put in their uh, change plus. So. Yeah, I'm really. If this is Albany's D team for Smash Bros, I'm, I'm really wondering how this Sora is not, you know, on their C team. I, I'd, I'd be scared to see uh, the people on there. I know a few of their people on their A team, and they're really good. Yeah, Albany seems to have a really strong esports program in general. Like... Yeah, their league team was also. We were going against their D team. Uh, and they were good. legends recently, and they were pretty strong. And yeah, I mean, they, they have a you know population of like a, a full city basically. So. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that helps. Yeah, their first, our first semester, we faced them in week eight, uh, mm -hmm. and we ended up losing zero to two. But I, I used to grind a lot with them. Uh, they were some of my good buds. So. Well, that's cool. <laughs> Shout like out to Albany. Yeah, the connection there. Hit Albany, high D danger. Yes, they have 17,000 uh, people that go to that school, so I'm sure finding a handful of Smash players <laughs> isn't too hard. <laughs> they, have seven, they have 17 times more people than we do. <laughs> yeah, but... A lot bigger bowl to pick from, for sure. New York has a pretty lively Smash theme, too. Like, oh, yeah. New York is just, in general, one of the best states for Smash. One of the yeah. biggest scenes in the country. Yeah, there's a whole triangle where it's uh, New Jersey, New York, New York yeah. City. It's called Tri-State. If you yeah, the Tri-State. Yeah. Yeah, they're they're probably the strongest region in the world. Close, closely followed by Georgia. Mm -hmm. Man, we should have gone to some locals in Georgia in the one night we had. <laughs> win, win. <laughs> yeah. We did not have time to do that. <laughs> you know. <laughs> Playing offline sounds really great right now. <laughs> I'd love to play some offline Smash. I got. Oh, invited. speaking of, while we uh, wait, there, there's a tournament coming up, right? Uh, at the Emory and Henry. Oh, yeah, go ahead and sell that real quick for the stream. Yeah, so this Sunday at 5 p.m., the esports program is hosting their first uh, Super Smash Bros. tournament. Uh, it'll open be open entry. It is open entry, free to enter. Uh, unfortunately, that does mean no prize pool unless. Possibly we get something worked up with that. Uh, but yeah, members of the esports team will be there across all games. Uh, I'll be there. This guy will probably be there. I'm gonna uh, try to make it. Yeah, we're gonna try to be there if we can, as yeah. well. Get my butt kicked. It's just, it's just entirely a fun time. Oh yeah, we've been trying to get some like this together since last year, so it's really great to see that we're doing it. Yeah, so they have, yeah, take they full advantage of the facility, you know. It's every year, right? Yeah, they used to have a Smash tournament once a year. 
Oh yeah. That was posted by the band program to kind of get people in the band. But now that we're not in band, uh, <laughs> the esports oh, yeah. program is hosting that. Yeah, and you know, I was involved with running those original tournaments, and I, you know, Ready? the fact that we're able to do actual open entry is sorry, Darkhead. <laughs> by good. the way, wait, I did, what? I, just, I wasn't I just looking. To me. <laughs> so this is here. Yep, so this is one of Bryant's other characters. Oh. Wow, that's interesting. <laughs> a bit of a gambit then, huh? Like, you know, Brian, try to see if this works. He started with Dark Pit when he first came into this That's program. interesting. I didn't know that. I, uh, uh, it's so going to be interesting to see how this goes, because I haven't seen him play in a while. So, yeah. so I, I feel like this matchup isn't too bad, because both characters just kind of mess with each other off stage. Yeah. Very true. Dark Pit is a very inconsistent character, though, with a lot of multi-hits. Right. So, just in terms of recovery, Dark Pit has a pretty nasty, uh, like, up B plus, you know, of course, the multi jump. Multiple jumps, yeah. Great mix up opportunity. However, the up B is very easily snuffed out. Yeah, true. It's pretty telegraphed. And right now, Sora. not a single percentage point on the Sora 70. Yeah. There, there we go, 10%. Ten 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 <laughs> we got the point blank Shot. melee arrow. <laughs> Shot him in the face, let's go. <laughs> he pulled that arrow out of his bow and just stabbed him with it. Oh, oh no. It's just a Man. different attack. First stock. Yeah. The Sora, that's how Sora died in uh, the end of yeah, round that, that one as well. That's how set one ended. So. Finally getting a little bit of revenge. I'm trying to make a pretty nasty read there, but it won't happen this time. Yep. He's Brian is doing good things. He's playing. Yeah, he's, he's, like, he's building a wall here, uh, this, trying to keep out the Sora. This is what you do against Sora. You build a wall. <laughs> Make the Sora pay for it, you know. Make <laughs> Sora pay for it. <laughs> Sadly, the up B oh, oh, no. no. Oh. That's Tries to angle the up B. Fortunately, it's not yeah. working. Whenever I've played Pit and Dark Pit, the recover like the upbeat always messes me up that way. Like, oh, okay, Sora will be ridiculous. Sora will be making it back because Sora can go to Asia and back and be fine. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Worldwide. Sora is literally Mr. Worldwide. Mm -hmm. I've seen this character make it back from the depths of heck. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Ooh, oh, nice. Uh, nice. Great. Sorry, and that, that does it. Has the super armor there, so I can catch through Sora's moves. That's excellent. Um, I mean, there's a real chance that uh, Brian could get the Sora out here. Um, it, 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 you just pay, keep playing patiently. Yeah. Yeah, you can just lock in, focus up. Don't get hit by any Sora shenanigans. <laughs> yep. Nice. Nice little electroshock. Keep building the projectiles and playing keep away. Yeah, that Guardian, that Guardian Arbitor. Man, if I could talk. <laughs> Guardian Arbitor is a great way to, uh, to keep Sora at bay. That didn't hit. This can Dang. actually not. Nice. Man. Man. I'm Sora's gotten that this round. Uh, I'm, <laughs> I'm livid. That doesn't work. <laughs> <laughs> that is I, unfortunate. I wish, I wish my character had those hitboxes. What the <laughs> yeah. that? And well, we're back to Eli. Except this time, Eli's got seven stocks to take. Yeah, I mean, if Eli can get rid of this last Sora stock without losing a stock himself, uh, again, I think there's a very real chance that we could run away with this. Um, it, it, it would be an uphill battle no matter what, but... Yeah, um, we've seen definitely. him do it before, though. Especially with a 9 stock. And there, I mean, like, you know, no shade to the rest of the team, but based on what we saw, like, the, um, the Sora is, like, 90% right now. Yeah, like, by far their yeah. best player. For sure. Sorry to their uh, Pyramithra and their Violith. But, Violet, you know, yeah. You know, sorry, that's a skill issue. <laughs> <laughs> I feel I feel like RB team's pretty well rounded. Oh I would yeah. Say the same thing, yeah. You know, it's definitely grown since last year. I'm happy to see the Smash teams growing more and more, consistently getting better and better. And you took up the hollow bastion. Eli, I'm going to strangle you. <laughs> oh my. Literally his stage. Like, that's yeah, that, where that's, he's from. That's, that's where he's from. Home team advantage. 
This is Sora's best stage. Yeah, <laughs> that's unfortunate. Um, but it Could will make it all the more sick if he can come back with the win on the home. <laughs> that's true. He's just um, trying to set up the narrative. <laughs> yeah. However, this is also Greninja, one of Greninja's better stages, so it's a matter of comfortability here. Or as uh, the great Avery likes to say, Gur Ninja. It's Gur Ninja. <laughs> Gur Ninja, not Gur Ninja. <laughs> it's, it's so funny to see that every time. Uh, I don't have to pay attention to that. <laughs> Next time. But simple stage, pick, stage switches right now, and we'll be fine. Uh, I'm hoping to see Eli pull out a 7 stock here. That would be... It would be... I mean, on the third round, I mean, that'd be incredible. Yeah, that'd be a great comeback. And here we go. So Eli knows, gotta deal with Greninja shenanigans once more. And here we go. Uh, potentially the very last uh, last fight we'll see. Hopefully not. Um, I, I, I have faith. I have faith that we're at least going to see the next character. Um, I yeah, I mean, the odds are pretty good of it. Like, yeah. you know, three to one stocks. At mathematically, um, it works. Yeah. <laughs> Let's hope skillfully it does. Mm -hmm. Eli just needs to take one. And if he can go forth without losing one, that'd be even better. Yeah, you can see Eli's trying to, I guess, sort of set the pace, continually kind of stay away right now. Um, Eli's doing what I've taught him to do, and that is to play in and out of burst ranges. Right. Which Sora's are consistently moving, so it's kind of hard to play around Sora at times. <laughs> yeah. Especially I mean, with those frame traps like that. Goodness gracious. Yeah. I, I, hell of an advantage already. 82% uh, for Sora. Uh, that wow, hit. that really That's hit. That's crazy. <laughs> I, I can already hear Eli slapping his knee right now. Oh, man. Oh, man. Eli slapping the knee. That'll be a simple 12% off of that. Which goes a long way if it's such a light character as Sora. Yeah, for sure. L little amounts of percent really do a lot of damage here. However, Sora can just dish that right back tenfold. Yeah. But, um, you know, uh, one stock meaning that every percentage is especially valuable. And... Uh, I I know it's hard. It's easier said than done. But trying to keep Sora like on the disadvantage on the ledge um, seems good. But it, it, he's so slippery. You know, it's just so easy to, for Sora to get out of like a bad situation. And oh man, kill. Sora's just gonna spot dodge and yeah, do moves that are super safe. You know, this is such a nice percentage too. It, it is pretty nice. Don't give, don't give him the power up. <laughs> get, get up! Get get out of there, Eli! Get out! Yeah, of there. All right, all right. All right. <laughs> Sora is now officially at kill percent. Anything above ninety is typically what you see killed. Yep. You can just get one smash attack and close this out. That would be ideal. Oh, yeah. man, these are making me nervous. <laughs> yep. Good recovery. Waiting for the four tilt. That oh, was, a, for the that was one of the, one of the counters of all time. <laughs> Oh, the, the machine gun fire into the grab. Yep, that is a true combo. Oh, is it? I Ooh, didn't know that. that. Almost a kill right there. Almost. That would have, but Eli oh, has no. the guy oh. in the back throw. One who's dead. Man. So here we go. And Sora's getting something started again. That did yeah. not hit. Oh my dear god. Oh, Sora, Sora, Sora yeah, is able to Sora safely jump at a disadvantage. Woo! Up, he probably would have killed there. Nope, not yet. This is, I'm, I'm tense, man. On the edge. I can so, tell we're all on the edge of our seats. <laughs> Eli's one kill confirmed from getting this. That was a. Oh, I went really, for the side B. That was that was a really risky play there. Thank goodness. Yes. Oh, yeah. Thank goodness. Oh. Yes, Eli. And we All know right. he can clutch this out. Like we've seen him. Like I said last week, it was a, he nine stocked. Uh, obviously, he's only got one, so he cannot afford to mess up. But yeah, no, this is um, the making of a, a pretty incredible highlight. Uh, if Eli can, you know, hold yeah, on to the momentum it. here. 
our our social media manager said they're going to start taking uh, nominations MVP for MVP. Yeah. So Eli, uh, <laughs> I'm wondering if that's on his mind right now. He's playing for the MVP nom, the yeah. Instagram uh, <laughs> clout. Uh, so here we go. What, what what will we see here? I'm. It's one stock. You can be as safe as possible. Uh, we'll we'll take a look. We'll see what we got here. Is it going to be? What do you, what do you think, Alex? Biolith or Pyramith are coming out here. Mm, I'm going to say the Biolith. Yeah, that's yeah. that's fair considering it's one stock and Biolith's got that kill power. Yeah, yeah, really good kill moves. Yes. One thing I'd love to see from Eli, which I barely saw last game, was just grabbing. That's one of Greninja's best way to get combos. So I'd love to see some more grabs out from Eli. Yeah, for sure. But... I wonder what stage we're going to. Um... Not Hollow Bastion. Get me off this Mickey Mouse stage. <laughs> Maybe uh, you think Kalos? Um... Uh, I mean, that's that's their pick, so. Oh, true. But... Eli, Eli can throw out bands. And he probably banned, I would guess, Battlefield. I would guess Smashville. Uh, I know he likes FD, so probably Yoshi's, honestly. Yoshi's probably the third pick. There's three bands across eight stages, right? One, two, three. Four. Yeah, eight stages, three bands. And no Dave Stupid Rule. Or DSR for short. So it's a coin toss. It looks like in the chat, the most recent message, just as a few minutes ago, this might have been, I don't know, previous round, but it looks like we banned Battlefield, PS2, and uh, Smashville. Yeah. Wow, banning PS2, what a. <sighs> what a cry. <laughs> That's interesting to see since uh, he picked uh, PS2 last game, or last round. That's a interesting choice from Eli. Just straight up bad luck this time. Not feeling it. Which PS2 is probably Pyramithra's best stage, honestly. If not Battlefield, so. Maybe that's why. Maybe they're trying to hedge against the Pyramithra. Yeah, it was, it's a good guess. Not gotten a message from the other team yet, so I, that's the uh, hang up here, I suppose. <laughs> Thinking real hard. Uh, yeah. <laughs> it's fun. For sure. For sure what I know is that once Eli snowballs, it's hard to stop. But yeah, again, it's all, I think like, you know, in terms of mental, the momentum, if you can get that momentum going and like, yeah, start snowballing, um, that'd be big. Yeah, absolutely. I keep uh, checking the chat to see if we've heard anything from them. I'm checking my watch, it's been what, like three minutes now? It's been a while, yeah. <laughs> Oh, so four minutes. So if they don't say anything within four minutes, then they have to forfeit a stock. But yeah, we 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 going for that we'll angle. Start. I mean, hey, I, I mean, whatever gets us the win, am I right? Right. Yeah. <laughs> I imagine that Gold does not take keeping track of time. Uh, but I'll, I'll I'll text him. I'll be like, hey, <laughs> yo, you got you got a four minutes left. Just in case you need an an option and out, <laughs> here you yeah. go. Oh, we have movement. Small battlefield. That's a, oh, yeah, that's, that is what they pick, yeah. Yeah, like I said, it's a comfort pick for pretty much the whole team, so... <clears throat> and and it is the Pyramithra, yeah. Oh, yeah, Pith Pyra exists. Jeez, completely forgot about Pyra. Yeah, yeah, this is probably the right move to take one stock with, unless this Pyramithra is really uncomfortable with Greninja, which we're going to hope that's the case here. Yes, yeah. Commentator bias. Oh yeah, it's blatant here in the Emory and Henry esports. Yeah, we, we, we're commentating for these, you see. We're commentating for Emory and Henry, so. Yeah, honestly. <laughs> oh, there we go. Okay. <laughs> a little eager beaver from the Pithra here. And here we go. I mean, I'd be nervous. I, 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 my nerves would be, um, like, on edge if I were yeah. against, uh, with one stock against the Fire Mithra. For sure. Mithra's game plan here is probably to just uh, keep Greninja out. Although this Mithra is just kind of throwing out random aerials, so yeah, that's kind of the thing to do, man. When you play Mithra, I mean, you can you can totally <laughs> just play with it because the insane frame. Dude. Ooh, that was got there. Oh, oh, scary! All right, oh, almost the full stuff right there. God, that does so much damage. 
Why did I do nine? What? <laughs> Character's stupid. Yep. And that now we're just seeing smash attacks thrown out. Uh, yeah, this is like it, not a know. great pace right now to get three stocks without dying. Uh, yeah. Not impossible. Like you said, it, uh, momentum's a huge part. Uh, yeah, snowballing. So, you know, the dream isn't dead, but yeah, this is. Fire for sure. Is... Oh, 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 damn. There it goes. is insanely strong. Well, great games to University at Albany D team. Fortunately, yeah. they. Well. They will take it this time. 2 1. It was a great set one, great set two, great set three. Yeah, I mean, it's always the more Smash, the better, you know? So even though we lost, uh, it's unfortunate we still got to see plenty of Smash, and that's always a good time. Yeah, going to three is always fun. And uh, yeah, both, both teams played well, both teams played hard. Uh, that Sora, a monster. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah what do you think the nature? odds that uh, Colt want, want... practices that matchup with the B team? <laughs> Well, I, looks like I got homework to do for, uh, to work on Sora. <laughs> yeah, that was, that was nasty. Uh, but thank you guys for being on the broadcast. Yeah, it's it was fun, fun having you. you guys. Thank you so much for having us here. Yep, it just, I can confirm, uh, in another one of our servers, in the ETSU one, uh, Eli just said, Where is Nate? Please help me of Sora. <laughs> and, oh, we love to see you with Eli. Eli... <laughs> That's why we love Eli. We talk about that uh, on, the con on, on, on here. All the time with him that he He's got the like, grind set, dude. He really does. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> I would I would argue he grinds probably as hard as I do for this game. <laughs> He's been on it this year, man. He's been going to so many tournaments and yeah. <laughs> it surely shows. He's been my co pilot for most of them. Uh -huh. Right. <laughs> yeah, it's it and it's been cool seeing like honestly both teams improve, uh like based on how it went last year. Uh, it's it's really kind of satisfying to see the development happen, you know, uh, and players getting better. Uh, seeing you guys like going to the locals and all that, like it, it's dope. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Anyways, thanks y'all for joining us tonight. Uh, good job, B team. Shoutouts to University of Albany as well. So good matches tonight. But anyways, we we are going to head off of here. Make sure you guys sign up for our tournament next week. Yes, please. Yes. I'll I have to make that. Thank you for reminding me. <laughs> yeah, smash.gg like, no, at some point. <laughs> yes. uh, look, look, look for a link in the near future. Uh, um, Tomorrow we have Valorant, correct? Uh, yep. Is it, and then on Wednesday we have uh, Overwatch. Overwatch 2. Yep. Overwatch 2. Uh, it's I'm the second of. Overwatch. And then <laughs> on Friday we have uh, League of Legends. So we've got another, a full week of broadcasting uh, to look forward to. So feel free to tune in. Uh, we've been the Emory and Henry esports broadcast. Uh, thank you again to our uh, great players for joining in on the commentary. And uh, we'll catch you next time. Have a good night, everyone. See y'all. Hey. So the entire time during that stream, Aaron was talking to me, like on Discord DMs, and I blocked him so he would shut up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Savage. Blocking. Dang. <laughs> <laughs>Yep, we're learning Sora. Someone, Sora learn Zelda. Zelda. Dude, Someone like... learns Zelda. Someone learns Zelda. Someone learns Sora. I'm... I'll get I'll get to talking. To people. <laughs> I love hearing Aaron in the back. <laughs> I'll I'll learn Sora. Yeah, I got Aaron on the Sora. I'd like to see Aaron try. Uh... Aaron, what does IDJ stand for? Exactly. <laughs> 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 I gotta, I gotta let them talk. It's not just me. Uh, yeah, I'm the one on camera. <laughs> Big man on I, camera. I'm sitting here advertising Arizona half and half uh, tea and lemonade because I'm just thirsty. <laughs> yeah, we were talking about getting the G Fuel sponsor, right. dude. Yeah, it'd be easy because they give it. They to give anybody. it to everybody. Yeah, yeah. You show up with your hat in hand. <laughs> It's easy. <laughs> <laughs> we get our own G Fuel flavor. I was saying it should be honey flavored because, you know, like... Yeah.
Because wasps, dude. Like, they don't make honey. What a like, great way it's... to oof. <laughs> no, all right, that's all right, a, guys. That's a big oof right there. Yeah, no, the people don't want it. What a great way to don't want it. Lose all the yumminess. You guys don't like honey? I mean, on it, I've never had G Fuel. I'm never, like, I don't know. I like I mean, honey, I, but yeah, I G Fuel. Like, I like doesn't... honey, but not as a flavor.